story for you. I don't, what? I have a story for you. Okay. Do I have a story for you? Did you know what a damn beat is? Do I have a story for you? Like, I can't. Yeah, you just did it. Really? Yeah, like, oh, dude. I have. I have All right, can we just start the video? Yeah. Come like, over here. Basically, some shit went down, and I'm mad about it. So I brought Jen here to hold my earrings while I fucking fight this bitch. Just kidding. So I invited Jen here because quite the opposite. Why am I here? Because I'm not an angry Wait, person. Wait, I sound bitchy. <laughs> Why do I have a naturally like bitchy voice? You do. Yeah. Ugh. God. You're not though. She's not. Um, don't put this in. <laughs> Wait, that's other bitchy too. Oh, what do I do? Basically, I actually am mad about this story, but I'm not one to be ang like an angry person, right? Like I'm not a very angry person. Have I ever gotten angry at you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have. What the fuck? <laughs> I have to be very close to someone to get angry at them though. I feel like you say mean and bitchy things, but your voice is just so like, hi, and like I'm Alex, so it doesn't really sound that mean. <laughs> You're actually right because I I get told that I say offensive things. You do! Yeah. Jen's here because I don't get enraged easily and I needed someone to remind me that to get angry. Does that make sense? Why me? <laughs> Am I an angry person? <laughs> no, no. No, no, no. Oh, I, feel like, I feel like you were along for the ride the whole time. You know what I mean? You were the one friend that knew. Ride or die, baby. Ride or die. Hi, how are you tonight? Good, I'm really good. That Thank you. Great. Awesome. So why don't we just start from the beginning? Yes, of course. Where did this all start? How did it happen? Well, I moved into this apartment that we're sitting in right now. That's very beautiful. Yeah, I know. It's big. It's yeah. expensive. Oh. Mm-hmm. Wow. How, how much? <laughs> how much? <laughs> um... Oh, uh, sorry, that was That's weird. an inappropriate yeah. question. Okay, so Jen and I moved into our apartments at the same time. We both bought and bought interior designers, got interior designers at the same time. Jen, how was your interior designer experience? It was pretty great. Uh, she got it done really quickly and I liked it. Yeah. <laughs> Good for you. Um. My fucking sucks! I already feel uncomfortable that she's gonna watch this video. It's pretty ballsy of you to make this. I know! Like, I feel like she knows you're a YouTuber. Like, I feel like you guys talked about it. Yeah, we did. <laughs> I'm, I don't like, like you probably sent her your link. <laughs> I know, I did not send her my link. I'm not one for drama, which is like what people who are one for drama say, but I'm really not one for drama. So, I feel very uncomfortable that I'm making this. Honestly, if you're watching this, we should give her a fake name. Deborah. Um, I don't want to say Deborah <laughs> like again and again. No offense to anyone named Deborah. Um, no, it's pretty fucking rude. My mom's name is Deborah. I know your mom, it's not. Anyways, if you're watching this. Anyways, if you're watching this. <laughs> this is literally what you should do. Like, really over animated YouTubers. Anyways, thank you guys so much. What should we call her? Her name's Deborah. No, I said that I didn't like that idea. I think we should call her Sarah Beth. Eh. <laughs> Cheryl. I feel like Cheryl sounds a little older than the woman, the picture of the woman that I'm trying to depict. Oh, uh, so you're going for like 30 more of a five year old. Is like a Michelle. A Michelle. Mickey. Mickey. That was my dog's name. Um, I knew that. It's okay if you didn't. <laughs> uh, oh, wait, that is her name. <laughs> We need to just like do it. Yeah, literally just Michelle. 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 So when you hired Michelle to yes. be your interior designer, uh, what happened first? Was she good at communicating with you? Did you clearly express what you wanted for your apartment? Okay, I see the shade there. Thank you, Jen. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I mean, so you kind of you kind of know now that there was already an error. All right, listen, you know what? Unlike a normal story timer, I am going to claim my fault in this story because I am responsible probably for half of what went wrong. Yeah, for literally, I'm, I'm maybe more. Than maybe that. more. <laughs> Honestly, I paid for a life lesson. Wow. Basically. I don't know if that's something to celebrate. I never listen, so I would have to end up paying fucking $3,000 for a life lesson. I don't have like a clear sense of style. I didn't know what type of furniture I wanted. So when she asked me, she said to me, Alex, what are you looking for? What kind of style are you going for? I had thought to myself, I hired an interior designer and I don't know what I want. 
So I made a Pinterest page for my apartment, sent it over to Michelle, said, girl, look at this um, and do what you will, do what you can. And then this is honestly also my fault. She asked me when she should come put this stuff together. And I did want it done soon. I did, I did. But I am such a fucking dumb ass pushover that when she asked me, I was like, uh, anytime works, uh, just uh, you bring it by. Uh, that's not true, I'm not like that. Yeah, that was a lot. <laughs> I basically was just like, hey girl, don't worry about it, do what you will, yeah? But she did extend that a little further than, than necessary. Yeah, like eight months further? June, July, August, September, October? Yes. Six months! Yeah! Okay, okay this is no longer my fault <laughs> now that I'm reanalyzing the story. So six months later, Joanne brings over Michelle. <laughs> Michelle came over and dropped this stuff off. Did I like the apartment? Why don't you answer? Did I like it? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I did. I did. I liked the upstairs. I liked the upstairs a lot. The downstairs was okay. I didn't love it. But like, honestly, again, my fault because I didn't tell her what I wanted. You should title this video how I didn't know what I was doing and I lost $2,000. <laughs> After she dropped my stuff off six months later, honestly, this is my fault too. There was like a list of things that I also wanted in my apartment. So I put together that list and I asked her to, um, to do that stuff as well. <laughs> So I rehired the person that took six months to bring me my stuff. Oh, this is all my fault. You know what this is a big metaphor for? Your life. Yeah. I let people treat me like shit, and so they treat me like shit. And my therapist right now. Yeah. That is what happened. Right Do you agree? Yeah. I gave her the leeway and she used it. Just like everyone else in my life. <laughs> So I gave her the list of stuff that I wanted and she told me it was gonna be $5,000 and I said hey 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 lady That's a lot. Let's cut down some of those things and then I had a list worth of $3,000 some of the stuff on that list includes um, a Noise canceling machine new curtains carpet for the staircase carpet for the staircase stuff for the bathroom Just stuff right so what are you adding? <laughs> after you asked for the second list of items? What happened did she bring the items immediately? Did she bring the items you asked for? No and no. <laughs> Am I a bitch by association right now? Oh, like you're not even involved in this. Well, everyone just cut Jen off the on the loose. She's fine. It's all me. I made her do this. I literally made you do this. Yeah. I made her come over, so. That's that. So she came like three months later with the stuff that I asked for. Um, so that it just repeated itself. History repeats itself. Okay. The issue that I had though, like fine, fine. She took six months, right? Fine, she took three more months, right? Fine, fine. My lease is up in two months, fine. <laughs> but um, my issue is with what she brought over the second time. I think maybe three items that she brought over are what I asked for. The rest I in no way, shape or form requested and are so ugly and do not go together so much that I literally feel like she didn't do the work, grabbed a bunch of shit in her own house maybe. <laughs> brought it over. So today we're doing a haul for you. If you guys want any of this shit, by the way, literally just say what it is you want down below and I'll give some of it to you guys. I'll ship it to you. As long as you don't live far away. <laughs> Alright, so let's do a haul of the shit that my interior designer brought over that is not what I asked for. 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 <laughs> Yours sounds like you're like, not what I asked for. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to sing. Not what I asked for. Not what I asked for. Not what I asked for. I feel bad because I'm gonna call a lot of this stuff ugly. It's just my preference. I don't mean to offend you, and I'm like literally giving it to you guys and saying how much I hate it. You're like, ew, ugly. You guys wanna take it? Give away. I think everyone can agree that all together it's pretty ugly though. So that's that's one thing we can all agree on. Yeah. Why don't you start handing me some of the stuff, Jen? Item number one. It's okay. I wouldn't buy it, but it's okay. So this is meant for this couch, right? Let's see what other pillows she got. For this couch? For this couch. Pillow number two. That one's pretty bad. I don't think I'd buy that. Yeah, I think we have a general consensus on that one. Pillow three. It's, it's just like awful. It's just pillows. awful. What is this? You're supposed to put 
put it on a wall. It hangs up like this. Oh, but she didn't hang it for you. That was the other thing. When she came over, she just dropped a bunch of shit off. I scheduled for her to come over twice. The first time, there was a storm the next day, and she canceled. Fine, though, right? Because there was a storm. There's a storm, like, I can't come over and go inside your apartment. Yeah, and her reasoning was because she'd have to bring a ladder from outside up here to change these paintings because I didn't really like them. And um, she didn't even do that no. when she came over. That was just a bullshit excuse that it was raining the next day. It also like was, it was like drizzling. The second time she told me, I'll probably be able to do it this day, but I might be out of town. I'll let you know. And you know what happened? She didn't let me know anything. And then a lot of time went by and I finally sent her a text and I said, hey mama, this is not okay. I don't normally get mad at people, but I did. I texted her and I was like, listen, it's taking you a really goddamn long time to bring this stuff over. I honestly just want you to return all of it and give me my money back. And she told me no. <laughs> she told me too much time had passed. That was her fault because she didn't drop it off. So, I mean, she couldn't return anything. So she said, I'll, I'll just drop it off. I'm not giving you your money back, so whatever the fuck. So she dropped off this stuff. That's what happened. Oh, this doesn't match one thing. But my favorite part is that oh. it is um, a DIY stool. It's like coming off at the bottom. It looks like this stool could have been no more than $10. I think... Less. Five. That's the beginning of my theory that she did not spend all $3,000 of mine. This is the best one. <laughs> she just wrapped it up. It doesn't even fit. This goes on top of a chair. This is the whole look. This could not get worse. We got more palm trees that I didn't ask Oh my for. god, this is the same fabric. Look, it's the same fabric. Me gets a framed photo of my chair. <laughs> This is, this is made up of like seven pixels. It's so blurry. Fucking hideous. People are gonna be leaving comments like, I want the fucking hideous photo at three minutes and 35 seconds. I promise you. Oh my God, what is that? I promise you guys, not one of you will want this photo. Yikes! This is ugly. Wait, this reminds me of something else. Oh my god, it's the same fabric as the pillow! Pick up the pillow with the gold. And she sharpied black over it. Whoa, she did! <laughs> Shut up, No Beth. way! <laughs> Me gets a framed photo of my pillow! <laughs> this is <me. laughs> You can see the rest of the printer paper on the bottom and the side. It is so blurry. What is this? Nothing! There's nothing in it! She just gave me a photo frame. This was $70. That's a lot for something that you're literally Never not going to use. All right, so the story doesn't end here, but there is a finale piece. <laughs> I forgot we didn't show this yet. What is this? No way. No way. No way! She did not spend three thousand dollars. Okay, that this is the major issue here, and that is was stuff that I didn't want. So I said, I'm confused if this was everything. This was three thousand dollars worth of stuff. I feel like half the stuff I asked for isn't here, and there are things I didn't ask for. Also, the fabric on the chair downstairs is falling off the chair. We were back and forth. Look at this mat. Last message she sent me. We had a breakup. She basically said, I didn't actually spend all of your money. It's not three thousand dollars worth. It's a seventeen fifty worth. And then I billed for my time and my services. <laughs> <laughs> That's why she literally bought like eight dollar pieces of fabric. Yeah, and then she kept all of so it so that she could keep the rest of the money and spend as little as possible. This is not worth seventeen hundred fifty dollars. No, no. Dude, this is people taking advantage of you. I know. You have to start standing up for yourself I know. and just being honest about what you want. Speak up. Speak up. Stop letting people push you around. Yeah, I invite people to do so. You literally are like, hey, come shit on me. <laughs> Like, hi, I'm, I'm Alex, walking. like, shit on me right now. <laughs> oh, you have to poop? Do it on me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess that's the end of this video. <laughs> thanks for watching. Thanks for coming on the show. <laughs> thanks for having me. Yeah, and thanks for being such a good friend. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> and subscribe to Jen. And, um, I'm sorry, Michelle. <laughs> Bye.